All right guys, so in my last video, I had came to this same skate park because they had added a new rail here not too long ago. It was my very first time skating it. Because I was out for a while, you know, not skating, I was kind of just taking it easy. You know, just doing some basics, some warm-ups, just trying to get the feels back. But I had a lot of fun. I wanted to come back for a second session and kind of just do some better tricks, you know, just see what tricks I still got, what I don't got. My goal is to do at least do 10 decent tricks, the tricks I haven't already done on it. But yeah, that's how we're gonna start off today's video with the early morning rail sesh. I got something to prove I gotta take what I hate and finally make a move I think of you and all the shit you don't do Well I'ma make hella sure that I don't become you I have no regrets, yeah I'll tie up my chest I'll never forget what it's like to be in debt Been stabbed in the back bed, I'll show you what happens Pass me the mic and I'll show you with action I feel this pain, you already know Turn that to gains, let my money show I've got these things that I can't let go Watch me turn this life into something that you could never own I feel this pain, you already know Turn that to gains, let my money show I've got these things that I can't let go Watch me turn this life into something that you could never own Now me personally, the reason why I prefer to skate a circle rail is because it's kind of hard to lock in on certain tricks. Not so much like the skinny squared rails, more like the real wide ones, like the ones you see. Some skate parks will have like little, little handrails and they'll be like real wide. And they're just kind of hard to like put your trucks in, like to like lock them in like the right way to like get through the grind. Okay, like so for example, I feel like, you know, feebles, you know, backside or front side or even just like Smith grinds, backside Smith, front side Smith are like so much easier on circled rail. I don't know if it has anything to do with the kingpin. The grinds come out like way smoother. It's just easier to like go all the way through. I feel like squared rails are more for like sliding tricks. You know, it doesn't make a difference with slide tricks, you know, four slides or even just like your basic 50s. You know, you got both your trucks on there. That's just how I've always, you know, been comfortable, you know, with certain tricks on squared rails and circled rails. I just will always love skating circle rails more. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Yo, Nick. All right, so I got a quick question. All right, so what would you rather prefer to skate? A circle rail, like a round rail, or a squared rail? Circle. Why? Um, okay, because a lot of people say flat, because you can lock on and everything. But uh -huh. I say round, that way, whatever you learn on a round rail, you can take it to a flat bar like nothing. If you stick on a round rail, you stick on anything, pretty much. I don't know, every time you skate a flat bar, it's great and everything, but at the same time, you can also get caught in your bushes. Doesn't it doesn't have to do with like the kingpin too or? A little bit. Some right? people, uh, they get caught under smiths and their grinds. Exactly uh, dude, that's what I was saying. That's what I explained in yeah, the beginning. Ground rows, my okay. Yo, I got a quick question for you. The topic of this video. What would you prefer to skate? A round rail, like a circle rail, or a squared rail? Squared rail. What? Squared rail? Hell yeah, it's easier. Why? It's easier? Because it locks in place. A yeah, round but row, you got a balance on it. I feel it's easier on a square row. Circle row is just too much work. Yeah, I'll tie up my chest, I'll never forget